You can't buy love, but you sure can foster or adopt it. Hey, I'm Lucha Morales, and this is Houston Happenings. It's all about the Paws at Bark, the city's animal shelter and adoption facility. Each day, Bark shelters hundreds of surrendered pets and animals. But when some of those pets need some extra TLC due to an illness, Bark turns to fosters for help. The Sniffles and Sneezes program was recently launched here at Bark. It is designed to foster the uh, kiddos here at the shelter who are maybe not feeling their best. They might have a minor upper respiratory infection. So they go into a home where they can de-stress, get the medicine that they need for 7 to 14 days, and then come back healthy, happy, and adoptable. Every year, Bark Animal Shelter takes in approximately 26,000 animals. And we highly rely on fosters in our adoption program. Fostering an animal from Bark helps the shelter clear up space for new animals that are incoming every day. And it also allows a better adoption period uh, for the animal because their foster parents can take pictures of them, find out behaviors that they normally wouldn't see in a shelter setting. If you're interested in fostering with Bark, Bark will provide a leash and collar for your new foster pet. Uh, we'll loan you a crate if you'd like a crate. We'll also provide a bag of food and all medical care is free here at Bark for your foster pet for the duration of foster. So we want to try and make it as easy as possible for you guys to help us help these pets get better. If you're interested in fostering and being part of Bark's Sniffles and Sneezes program, visit HoustonBark.com and click on I Want to Foster. You can also email or call Bark. Well, I hope you enjoyed this episode of Houston Happenings. I know we did. Make sure you like and subscribe to our videos. Until next time, I'm Lucha Morales, and this is Houston Happenings.